Lloyd Pierce deserves a lot of credit for how Trey Young got free in the fourth quarter of their game against the San Antonio Spurs. Check out this set that he ran a few times. As the dribble handoff occurs on one side, the big man raises as the ball gets passed to Trey Young. Because Young is so high and is being hugged, Pirtle, the Spurs big man, can't get high enough to hedge on this screen. Over by the coaching hash is still in Trey Young's range, and he gets an open look. Franchise scorers and number one options like Young can't disappear in crunch time. Remember that set we told you to watch for before, with that dribble handoff and the big sprinting into a cut? Now the Hawks have to run it differently because Patty Mills is hugging Trey Young so far above the line. The direct pass to Young isn't there, so instead the Hawks are going to flash the big man and hit him above the high post. As he catches it, he's looking for Trey Young on a back door, a blind pig action. But Young notices that Mills is starting to overplay it, pops it back, and gets a handoff and a screen middle for the perfect three. Watch for that exact same play again as soon as we get into the half court. The dribble handoff, the flash from the big, and the overplay. Mills is once again hugging Young and is prepared for the blind pig back door. And this time, instead of trying to run a handoff for Young, the Hawks utilize him as a screener. Knowing that the Spurs won't help an inch off of Young, he hopes that this screen helps eventually get him a little bit more open. They fake the dribble handoff with the man from the corner and curl him, using a diversion to get Young the ball back in his hands. Once he has it, he treats this like a pick and roll, dragging LaMarcus Aldridge, the hedge defender, far away from his man. Now Young just reads the play going to his left and finds the wide open shooter in the corner. Even though the Hawks don't score, this is playbook symmetry meeting great skill from Young.